A Texas man is charged with felony theft under uh, after investigators linked him to an odd plot to steal more than $1.2 million worth of fajitas over nine years. I, I'm listening. Former Cameron County uh, Juvenile Justice uh, Department employee Gilberto Escamillo missed work one day in August for a medical appointment. The same day, a delivery driver called the kitchen about having 800 pounds of fajitas to drop off. <laughs> oh, Oh, so woman, this was like a one-time thing? A woman informed the driver that the juvenile department did not serve Tex-Mex food, but the driver said, listen, I've been delivering fajitas here for nine years. <laughs> what do you mean you don't serve them? When Mr. Escamilla oh, reports to work the next story. day, he is confronted with the discussion, and he admits, I have been stealing fajitas for nine years. I love this story. Escamilla was fired. <laughs> That month, arrested <laughs> after investigators obtained a search warrant. He got warrant greedy. That's and what found, happens. He got and greedy. found packages of the Tex-Mex food in his refrigerator. <laughs> they also checked invoices and determined he would intercept yeah. county-funded food deliveries and then deliver them to his own customers. Mm-hmm. Oh, so he was, he was selling, selling them. Selling them. Yeah. yeah I was going to say, that's a lot of fajitas he was eat, He was determined to have stolen one... million two hundred and fifty one thousand five hundred and seventy eight dollars worth of fajitas. I love this story. This he one says, better win. It, he says, if this wasn't so serious, it, the uh, a reporter or uh, a spokesperson said, if this wasn't so serious, you would think this was a Saturday Night Live skit, but it's the real thing. Boner candidate number two. That's a man who loves his fajitas. So how's it going to do? It's going to win. Fajitas are going all the way.